Our aim is to make sure that we are the kind of faculty um, who, at the end of the day, you know, it is about caring. It is about um, being concerned about what happens to every single young lady at this school. And it is about providing um, the type of environment that they feel comfortable coming and talking with you, sharing with you um, their struggles, their hopes, their dreams, their achievements, and nurturing that type of relationship. We're that kind of school. The school has a strong climate built on college-bound culture and student leadership. We know that they are going to have to be problem solvers. They're going to have to collaborate. They're going to have to bring solutions to the table to problems that aren't even invented yet. And so because of these demands, we want to make sure that we provide them with opportunities to be successful in whatever field they choose. Leadership is also a key part of the school's climate. An elective class for juniors and seniors provides many opportunities for the girls to lead campus events such as Senior Signing Day. They strive to create a family atmosphere where each person is celebrated. My ultimate goal is to want to give the girls the opportunity to learn, to, to serve others, the opportunity to lead in something. A lot of times girls, some girls are timid and they feel that they're not natural leaders and so I try to instill in them that regardless of your personal characteristics that you can you can lead in different aspects and that not everybody has to be the person in charge but that every aspect of an organization, every aspect of, of a family needs somebody to take that lead once in a while and so for them to feel that they can contribute to something bigger than themselves um, and if they could all leave knowing that they can do that, that if they can all leave knowing that they have that opportunity to change somebody else's life or to make somebody else's life easier, then I feel that I've accomplished my job. The school developed an anti-bias curriculum to help students think critically about their world and to build leadership and empathy. Respect Starts Here is a program that we have developed at Irma Rangel to address issues of discrimination and bias in our society. Um, it's a year-long curriculum that we have been developing, pulling from existing curriculums like Teaching Tolerance and the Anti-Defamation League and providing lessons in our classes and opportunities for discussion so that our students, when they're ready to um, graduate, move to college and create change in our society, that they will be prepared. I think one of the most extraordinary things about our school is our ability to give young women the confidence to move forward in their lives. We have the ability here to give, provide opportunities for learning that extend way out of the classroom. Um, we are lucky to partner with many organizations in our community who provide those opportunities, but we also have the um, sense of urgency that those opportunities are necessary. Without fail, they all say that they've been successful because of the leadership opportunities that were provided for them at Wang Hill. And they are also able to share that with our current students so that they have something to look forward to. Because remember, it's not if you're going to college, it's where you're going to college.